really been a long time since I last did a collection video, but I got a lot of stuff in, so let's get started. First, I got Tetris 2, which is a decent game. Of course, not as good as the first Tetris, but whatever. RC Pro Am, it's a pretty fun racing game. Um, uh, probably as good as at Rad Racer. And Excite Bike, um, pretty fun. Goonies 2. This is a um, very underrated game. Uh, it's really cool. It's uh, kind of like um, what was that game? Metroid almost. It's like non-linear. You can go to um, like it's like um, the overworld is like a maze, and there's um, yeah. And Bart vs. the Space Team, which which is, I think, a pretty good game. Well, not pretty good game, it's just a good game, but a lot of people hate this game because it's really hard. Well, let me tell you, I swear, I beat this game today for the very first time, and it, well, it wasn't impossibly hard, but, um, it was pretty challenging. And speaking of challenging, Jackal. This game is hard. Really, really hard. Uh, better for a 3 <coughs> Yeah, this game is hard. Probably just as hard as Contra, but you know Konami, they always make hard games. Double Dragon. Um, this is a pretty fun beat em up. Not as good as um, Double Dragon 2, a bit better than Double Dragon 3. And now that I have Double Dragon 1, it means that I have the Double Dragon Trilogy on the NES, which is awesome. Next up is Chip and Dale Rescue Ranger. Really, really good game. Even better than DuckTales. Uh, um, yeah, it's a really fun game. Uh, I got these all for like pretty cheap. I got them all for, um, I think it was 20 bucks on Craigslist. Yeah. And Kung Fu, which is my first five screw game that I have. <clears throat> oh, yeah, and no, no, no. I opened this game up and, um, the motherboard inside this thing is like really really small. I took a picture of it and I'll show you at the end of the video. So yeah, what I mean by five screw is that it has five screws on the back and the top is flat. That's smooth right there. Not like any other game that um, has these little chips and has three screws up here. Which I think is pretty cool. Um, it'd be pretty cool if you guys shared uh, what five screw games you have. So, anyway, the, my favorite NES game ever, which is pretty cliche, but whatever, Mario 3. Yeah, I finally got this game. Um, I was, I've been looking for this game for a really long time. Um, and, yeah, I got it for, like, five or six bucks on eBay. Um, yeah, it's a pretty good deal. Now I have the Mario Trilogy. Alright, the only Super Nintendo game I got was... Super Scope 6, and you know what that means? That means I got the Super Scope. Oh yeah, got it for 15 bucks, and I got it with the Center. So yeah, that's pretty awesome. But there's a catch: it does not come with the actual scope, which really sucks. But whatever. The only N64 game I got was Golden Eye. Oh yeah, this game is really, really awesome. Just like everyone says, it's just awesome. And Metal Gear for the PS1, which, uh, uh, I don't think too much of this game. I'm not a big fan of stealth, stealth games, but, uh, my brother pestered me to get this game, so I got it, and I don't know, I might give it a really, um, like, in-depth try later on, but, um, two Sega Genesis games, the first one, oh, Aladdin, which is crazy hard, um, it's pretty good, though. And World of Illusion starring Mickey and Donald, which is a really, really cool game. So, um, yeah, you should pick the game up. And Aladdin, um, which are pretty, pretty cool games. And for the Game Boy, actually I got a Game Boy Color, which is in really good condition. It's the teal one. And yeah, has a little butt right there. And first of all, I got... Donkey Kong, which I noticed something. What's that? That's the 
European Seal of Quality, which I thought was really weird, because I also got this one off of Craigslist, and I, w I thought it was pretty interesting. There's a European Super Game Boy logo, so it's pretty cool. It works perfectly on my um, uh, USA Game Boy, all of them. Mole Mania, which is awesome, awesome, one of my top 10 Game Boy games, um, it's a puzzle game, which, um, you, like, you can, like, go underground and pop up somewhere, and, like, uh, you should, uh, I don't know, I can't really explain it, it's really cool, you should check it out on YouTube videos, you know, gameplay videos, see if you like it, and Mickey's Dangerous Chase, I got, um, this is, like, a Chip and Dale, like, game on the Game Boy. It's pretty fun. Uh, yeah, I got it for uh, five bucks at Games Plus, which is a Houston-only store. It's a pretty good store. If you're in the Houston area, you should check that store out. It's along um, Highway 6 and um, what was it? It's on West Stokes Mall along Highway 6. And now um, for the Wii I got New Super Mario Brothers Wii. I got it the day it came out, like the morning it came out. Not sure if I was the very first per I was the very first person to get to the store and get this game because I saw that they were just opening the box for and uh, getting out the copies for this game, and I was uh, the first one to that store. Not sure if I'm the first person like in the city to get, ever get it, but whatever. That's pretty cool. I got a few accessories here. First off, the Game Genie. It's the gold version. And the best part about this is that I got it for five bucks and it came with the code book. Now, what's cool about the code book is that it it's the absolute latest version of the code book. Really late release came out. Um, it says right here. Um, gosh, not sure if you can see it. There it is. 1994. That's where it says right there. You can't see it. Crap. Well, that's where it says right there. Um, comes with all the the very last games for the NES. Uh, comes with like Mega Man 6, Zelda's Revenge, Star Tropics 2. Um, so, um, <laughs> yeah. Last thing is the NES Advantage. Which, um, it's really cool, I can like play Ninja Turtles 2 on it. It's like an arcade stick. The joystick is a bit stiff, sort of. A little, I don't know. It, um, it, well, not really, but it's, um, it's okay, but it can get annoying sometimes. Um, so, yeah, it's all my stuff I got now. Alright, hope you enjoyed. Thanks for watching. And like, um,. In about a week or so, I'm gonna do a second one because I got a few stuff in the mail. Well, actually, a lot of stuff in the mail, so yeah. Uh, check that out too. Alright, uh, see you later.